What's up, YouTube? Welcome back to another Lead Code SQL problem. This time we have one that's marked as easy and part of SQL 50. Let's get into it. Now, this one's called Find Followers Count. It's numbered 1729 and it's part of the sorting and grouping section of SQL 50. We only have one table to work with, which is called followers. We have a user ID and follower ID in there, and it sort of denotes the follow relationship in a social media app. We want to follow our follows another user. Our task is to write a solution that will, for each user, return the number of followers. We should return the result table ordered by user ID in ascending order. And we have some example data down below. So user ID zero has user one as a follower, vice versa, one has zero as a follower, two has zero, and two also has one as a follower which would give us this example output. User ID zero and one have one follower while user ID two has two followers because yeah, there's two entries here in the followers table. One more thing to note maybe is that user ID and follow ID is the primary key, that combination of columns. So these will have unique values always, meaning that there are no duplicates in this table, which might be relevant for counting the amount of followers a user has. Speaking of counting, that's pretty much what we have to do here. So let's select the user ID as well as a count function from this table followers. And yeah, in terms of the count, we want to count the number of followers that a user has. We don't have any duplicates in the table and one row should be one following relationship. And since we're yeah, selecting this per user ID, we're gonna group by user ID. We could basically count star here, which would just count the amount of rows. We could count follower ID. We could count distinct follower ID, but it shouldn't make a difference because the table is already not containing any duplicates. So yeah, I'll just do count follower ID from followers. And since we're asked to calculate the amount of followers for each user, we need to group by user ID to only count them for each user and not across the entire table. So only thing left to do is to order by user ID in ascending order. So we'll be typing out order by user ID ascending to do that. I think for the output column, we want the second column to be called followers count. So let's do that too and submit that solution to see whether it's accepted. And that should be it. Yeah, so this one's accepted. This one is very easy. It's just pretty much the most basic thing you can do within sorting and grouping. So that's a good place to start if you're a beginner, but we're gonna pick up the pace soon and look into some mediums and hard as well for SQL 50. There's a lot of questions still out there. They're a medium, what's even hard, and yeah, some mediums tend to be pretty hard. So yeah, that's about it for this question. If you want to follow along, I have a playlist for all of the questions in SQL 50. So feel free to check this one out and I'll see you in another video. Bye-bye.